Welcome, and follow me is an Asus Zenfone 9 and today I will show you how you can hard reset this device through recovery mode in order to get rid of things like screen locks. So, to get started I'm gonna quickly lock the device just so you can see that I do have a pattern set and I'll progress from the lock screen as though I wouldn't know my pattern. So, number one we're gonna hold I believe power key and volume down. Oops, let's try that again. I guess that would work too if I keep holding it. It will forcibly reboot the device, but it's not necessarily what I was looking for, so I'm gonna try... Ah, so it's just a power key here. So, yeah, once you hold power key, we can then select power off. This will turn off the device, and once the phone is off, you wanna hold power and volume up at the same time. You will see the start. Once you do, let go of the keys and then using volume keys. You want to select recovery mode. Once it's visible right here, press power key. And as you can see, this will take us to the recovery mode. So from here, using again volume keys to navigate, you want to select wipe data factory reset and then confirm it with power key. Select yes. Confirm it, give it a second, you can see wiping data, and data wipe complete, come on, ah, there we go. Now once you see the data wipe complete, uh, reboot system now will be selected by default, so press power key once again. This will initiate a reboot and continue the process in the background. Now it will take the device about like a half a minute maybe a minute to finish it up and once it has we will then be greeted with android setup screen so i'll be back once that is visible oh okay as you can see it's already finished so from here you can set up your device however you want assuming it is not locked now if it is locked uh, which is how it is for me as you can see uh, which just to clarify this, the device becomes locked if you perform this when you are logged into your Google account and you have a screen lock. So I have done this purposefully to lock the device because I'll also make a video on how you can bypass this. So if you perform this and your device is now FRP locked, uh, in the next video you can learn how to remove it. But for this one, that would be it. So if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe and thanks for watching.